Hey guys, Manuel Sanchez here. Thanks for tuning in. Let me start off by saying what a crazy, crazy real estate year we had in 2021. This was obviously fueled by low inventory and high buyer demand. But I'm curious, did any of you watching this video, did you buy or sell a home in 2021? Comment below. I want to know your story. Was it good? Was it bad? How was your experience? But anyway, if you are currently a homeowner who plans to sell in 2022, you may think that the wise thing to do is wait for the spring buying market since historically about 40% of home sales occur between April and July. And many of you may think it's because of the seasons, the weather seasons. Well, yes and no. At least here in San Diego, we don't really have crazy seasons. I mean, it's winter right now, it's a little bit cold, it's 65, sunny, and no clouds in the sky. Here in San Diego, our season is mostly based around the school year. So we do tend to see more homes come to market around the summer and around November, December. Having said that though, we expect this year to be much different than the norm. Here are five reasons why you should list right now instead of waiting for the spring. Number one is buyers are looking right now and they are ready to purchase. Believe me when I say that. Reports from the website Showing Time show the data that more than 6 million property showings are scheduled across the country each month. In other words, it tells us how many buyers are out looking at homes at the current time. Number two is other sellers plan to list early this year. The law of supply and demand tells us that if you want the best price possible and you want to be in a position uh, to negotiate the ideal contract, putting your house on the market when there's strong demand and less competition is key. A lot of sellers are planning to list their home later this year instead of right now which tells us that if you wait to sell, then there will only be more competition. And by competition, I mean more homes on the market, which means more options for buyers. If you're looking for the best price and the ability to negotiate terms for the sale of your house, then list before the competition hits the market. Number three is new construction will be competition in the spring. In 2020, there were over 979,000 new single family housing units authorized by building permits. Many of those homes have yet to be built because of labor shortages and supply chain bottlenecks brought on by the pandemic. Well, they will, however, be completed in 2022. That will create an additional competition when you sell your house or if you wait to sell your house till later this year. Number four, there will never be a better time to move up. If you're moving into a larger home, more expensive home, consider doing it now. Prices are projected to appreciate by 5% over the next 12 months. That means it will cost you more both in down payment and mortgage payment if you wait. You can also lock in a 30 year housing expense with a mortgage rate in the low threes right now. So if you're thinking of selling in 2022, you may want to do it now instead of waiting. Remember that mortgage rates are forecasted to rise throughout this year. Number five, it may be time for you to make the change. After that pandemic, at least here in San Diego, there's a lot of people who lived in condos that are now looking for that extra bedroom to work from home or that bigger lot where they can build a, a granny flat or they can go outdoors and enjoy uh, their backyard with their kids. So consider why you're thinking of selling in the first place and determine whether it's worth waiting. Is waiting more important than having the space you truly need? Only you know the answer to these questions. Bottom line is take time to think about your goals and priorities as we start this new year and consider what's most important to act on now. If you have been debating whether or not to sell your house and are curious about market conditions in your area, then let's connect, shoot me a DM, give me a phone call, my contact information is down below. This way you will have expert advice on the best time to put your house on the market. Thanks for watching. If this video added any value, appreciate it. If you would hit that like, hit the subscribe button, share with your friends, and, uh, and yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.